we're going to be taking out this magnolia. Those start dying in the fall. The majority of the limbs I can drop right in this hole in his backyard right here. Drop him right in here. You can see I'm going to put ropes and knees back here to get them over. There's a lot of back weight. And removing dead trees is a little more tricky because the wood, the fibers aren't usually there, usually dried out, so there's really not a lot of fibrous wood in it. Meaning when I make the notch and then do the back cut, they usually tend just to snap. Instead of having some play in the wood. Looks like it was topped before too. You can see the, uh, the fist right there. And the new growth coming out. So I'm just cutting the tree down. I'm leaving it a stump. I'm going to make more of a mess if I uh, take the stump out. And this uh, ivy will grow over the stump. little piece there that was coming over to the house we just put a rope in that and yanked that over and we're gonna do the same thing with this right one <clears throat> well that back leaning piece came off perfect you can see the nice hinge wood that was here and then when applied with the uh, pull rope on it, it went right where we got wanted it to go. So it's all about rope placement too. I put the rope in the furthest limb going over this backyard. That way we get all that weight right where we want it to go. 